Hi guys, today we're going to talk about adrenal fatigue and what the exact effects are on the body. So adrenal fatigue is a collection of symptoms such as brain fog, mental fatigue, physical exhaustion, sleeplessness, um, and steroid hormonal imbalance in the body. Um, so what exactly is an adrenal gland? Adrenal glands are small, walnut-sized glands that sit on top of the kidneys, and they produce um, many hormones in the body such as cortisol, DHEA, testosterone, estrogen, um, and adrenaline. <clears throat> when, you're con when your body is constantly under a large amount of stress, your cortisol production goes up. So you may have heard commercials talking about cortisol leads to belly fat and a lot of other things. It also can be a beneficial hormone. It really helps fight inflammation in the body. The problem is, is our bodies are designed for quick, short impulses of stress when we need to get away, such as the fight or flight syndrome. When you have chronic stress all the time, your adrenal glands eventually wear out. So if you can think of holding your arms up straight, you can do that for hours. As soon as someone comes along, starts pushing down, pushing down, pushing down, you can only hold out for so long because your adrenal glands just aren't meant for that. So what happens in the body? Why do you start feeling tired and exhausted and mentally foggy? Well, what happens is, is your hormones start having to try to rebalance to compensate for all this stress. Your body's not used to it and it doesn't know how to handle it. So all of a sudden you'll start seeing your energy levels start to plummet, your excitement and your happiness, your mood can change, your sleep schedule may start being off because when your hormones are out of balance, everything starts to fall under. So. I know this sounds like the absolute world is over. You may feel this all the time. And you're like, I don't know what to do. Everyone says I'm fine. The doctor says I'm fine, says it's all in my head. It's not. This is a real thing, and we go through it all day. Um, so common things you can do. One, make sure you have a really, really good diet and exercise program. That's the easiest way to start off. And I know a lot of you say, well, I don't have the time for that. I'm already stressed that it is. Make the time. Um, your body will undergo changes as you're doing the diet and the exercise routine that will actually help combat the stress. Um, number two, make sure you're getting to bed at the same time every night, waking up at the same time every morning. This is a really simple way that you can really help reset your body's clock to get it back functioning properly again. Sleep is a really, really important thing and it can regulate all the other symptoms of adrenal fatigue as well. Um, number three, there are some supplements that you can also go on to help you. Um, that will be up to you as far as you want to do that, but there are many adrenal support products out there. The fourth thing I recommend is I also do offer adrenal fatigue testing and metabolic testing. I am a certified functional diagnostic nutrition practitioner, um, and so what we do is use lab testing to help diagnose and see where um, the imbalances in your body and we can figure out how to best help you restore your health and get your body back in balance so you're feeling great again. Um, so if you have any questions, feel free to make a comment.